Here's how to download and install CapCut. Let's go. Now, first head over to CapCut.com. You can also click on the link in the description down below. You can search it up yourself. And then once you're in this page, you want to scroll down and you want to go ahead and press where it says download. Keep in mind, they also have a CapCut online that you could go ahead and try, but let's go ahead and press download. That'll begin the download of the installer file on your computer. You could usually find this file on your recent download history on your browser, but within the downloads folder of your computer. And what I want you to do with this file is go ahead and place it on your desktop. Now, once you have this file in your desktop, you're going to double click on it. Now, that will most likely give you an admin prompt that my streaming software doesn't pick it up or my recording software doesn't pick it up but if you go ahead and press yes it will open the installer right here and then just go ahead and wait for it to finish downloading everything in here you could also see the location of where it is installing down here and you could change that as well from here now after it has reached 100 percent it will create a shortcut on your desktop and then it will launch automatically and it will say testing environment this is going to determine if your computer is powerful enough to run CapCut. but so far i've never had issues even on my laptops i've been able to install CapCut and run it without any troubles and then once you finish testing the environment it's going to say your computer can run CapCut smoothly just go ahead and confirm that in here that is going to open cap code after a couple seconds and then it's going to give you the terms and privacy policy you could go ahead and read through it if you want and then if you agree go ahead and press agree and continue and then you're kind of now ready to start using cap code you could create a project and of course they have a bunch of free functionality options that you don't need cap code pro to do and i recommend going through the tutorial in here in case you want to learn everything they have to offer but that is it guys you can now come back to your desktop and delete the installer since you don't need that anymore and now you have cap code in your computer if this video helped you guys don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you next time